Welcome to this episode of the Joy Ed Podcast. We're so glad to be back. Three weeks of consistency mm-hmm. after taking a much needed break. But this is still not season two. I saw someone asking yeah. that we promised that season two is coming in September, but now we're doing content. Yeah. What is the difference? What is the difference according to you, Ben? The difference Umele is wanini. season two will be a whole different episode, a whole different season. Yeah. But what we're doing in between is that we are still creating content. <laughs> What's the difference in the content? <laughs> okay, the difference in the content is that first of all, we're doing social experiments. Social experiments is where we'll have other people come play the joyride on the joyride podcast, but that's not us. Other joyriders. Other yeah. joyriders. That's one. Yeah. The number two, we're also going to be inviting other couples or other people, and then we have conversations with them before we start to before we start season two. Okay. And this these episodes are going to lead up to the joyride live experience compass edition which is coming on which is coming up on the 16th of july yeah i'm super excited about this because there's always this energy i get from guys in campus and i always had that energy yeah you know, where you just want to do stuff you know did you ever go for any gigs in campus i used to go for all oh, gigs. yeah me was that person who i remember when lacrae came to kenya lacrae had a master class for artists Oh, Even, you went. I went for that master class. <laughs> That's good. Like at 8 a.m. at Valley Road. Yeah. That's good. Good. So, Campasarians, I hope you guys have not changed the values of hard work, consistency, and just pursuing pursuing of success. I hope you guys will come. The out. Lecrae of this generation yeah. is coming to a campus near you. <laughs> yeah. So we we, we we're doing the 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 Jared Live experience at Daystar. Yeah. And this is also open to other guys in the public. It's not just for campus students yeah. only. Um, and by the time we're shooting this, there's some exciting news. Yes, 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 yes. Which is? This is big, man. Uh-huh. So when we started off, uh, the charges were 500 shillings for students, 1,000 shillings for non-students. But now we are saying it's at zero shillings students and 0.00 shillings <laughs> for non-students. Duru za kuaminika zinatueleza kwamba ripoti ambazo zinatufikia hapa katika ripoti yetu ya habari ya Joyride Joyride Broadcasting Network JBN, JBN Joyride Broadcasting Network. Back register hiyo jina sasa hivi. Na sasa tumeangalia na tumejua ya kwamba economy inakaa vibaya. Mm-hmm. Iko kwa kona. Mm-hmm. Na watu wa Joyride ni watu wa roho safi. We are very clean hearted people. Mm-hmm. So we want to announce to you the ladies Naam. and gentlemen. Naam. <laughs> Ah, Am I the spoiling it. Yeah, you're spoiling it. Don't worry, boy. Man, you yeah, yeah, yeah. Ruruna Lashid. But we wanna say that the prizes for the live recording, the Joyride podcast live recording at Daystar, have been wavered. Yes. So what this means, the Joyride live experience on the 16th of July 2022 mm-hmm. is absolutely. Free, free, no payments at all. Yeah. All you have to do is register on the provided link that we will share. But imagine Alex wako like watu ku anataka nini? Kila mtu apewe kiti yenye anataka. And big shout out and thank you so much to ALX Africa. Yes. Special thanks to ALX Africa who have seen it fit to pay for your ticket. So we hope you will we will see you on the 16th of July. Remember, now there's no reason for you not to come. It's absolutely free at no cost to you thanks to ALX Africa. Thank you so much. And before that we're going to be doing campus tours. We're going to go to Riara University, Strathmore University, Daystar University and the University of Nairobi. We will be giving master classes on content creation and how to create a career out of all that in conjunction with ALX. So nini 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 ngine inaweza kuwa ikiwa stress. Surely surely joy riders. Nini shida gani hizo zingine zenye zimebaki mniambia sasa hii zitatue. Maana 16th of July is going down. It's going down heavy at Daystar Valley Road. It's a jump packed July. I hope to see you in either of the four campuses or on 16th of July. See you then. Well. And this is only possible thanks to ALX yes. who have wavered the cost. And I really really love ALX um because of what they do. Hmm. Do you have an understanding of what they do? Yes, yes. I could tell you more about it. Tell me more as you tell the audience. Yeah. But I also have <laughs> Um, I really mind. like the way they <laughs> um, they're just looking out for young people empowering young people through the courses and um, opportunities that they offer I will leave a link in the description box to their website mm. you can check out the programs that they have mm. um, and the best part just like the joyride their courses are also at no cost to you 
they are free. Yeah. Their courses are free. At no cost to you. I I can't emphasize this enough. That yeah. the, the one thing people can never take away from you is, is the value, value you have created for yourself. Yeah. Like if you go, let's say you are um let's say you 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 are like the accountant mm. at the office. If you know how to work with a little bit more software, you become more valuable than any other person. Yeah. Adding value to yourself is one of those things that it's like I am a musician. Mm -hmm. I'm a podcaster. Oh, and so I'm you're saying you're a valuable writer. asset. I actually am. Like, <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Let other people praise you. <laughs> you know, after 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 now joining this new decade, I'm 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 gonna confidence level in me. In me panda. Me panda. So it's just that's what I'm trying to say. So I think this is a perfect opportunity for you to just check out what LX have to offer and yeah. get yourself into a class. Yeah. Now it's always interesting whenever you partner with people who think like you, mm -hmm. because one of the things that ALX is very keen uh, on, doing. on doing is empowering young people. Yeah, that's, that's also what, what we the joyride is about. That's what we've been sharing tips on how to 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 crack your content career since yeah. like the first episode we did of the Psycho Podcast. Yeah, so this is something that we are very passionate about, and thank you, thank you so much, ALX Africa, for just coming on board. Yep. Yeah. So by the time we this goes up. We'll have gone to Nairobi Uni. Yep. Uh, but we have three more unis that we're coming to. We are coming to Riara University, Strathmore University, and Daystar. Daystar. And Daystar, we are coming twice. Mm. Once on the 13th for the Creative Campus Workshop, and then on the 16th, CC Ward. Event. From all these universities, That's the plus event. others that we weren't able to come to, mm. we'll meet at the Daystar Uni yeah, yeah. for the live experience. I was asking you if maybe. Uh, for this Jared live experience, I should have Alice Kimanzi come on and as well as for your new Karin, song. Karin a Valor. great way to plug in your new song. Yeah, Tell yeah, them have about a new it. Song. Fire photo. <laughs> it's really, really, really uh, causing shocking waves. What, what, what is Who has told you about shocking waves? I <laughs> uh, have a new song called Salama. It's out today with the amazing Alice Kimanzi. And I was thinking maybe we should have her as well. As you wish, this, as the, the stage is yours. Live experience. The stage is yours. I'll give them a call. We'll just talk to the MC at Kina Barak and see. Yeah, the person to determine this is Barak. Yeah. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> a nope. Like, what's the budget here? <laughs> anyway, let's get to the episode. So yeah. today's episode is light and fun. Mm -hmm. Um... Do you want to get started? Yeah, first we it's, need to tell guys that these questions are not by Barack as usual. Yeah. The questions are from the people. You who are questions subscribed are from you people. To our newsletter. So, you know, the way like the questions are Barack, you get to understand that hey, yeah, the person who did these questions is very intelligent. Mm. <laughs> I guess this is also our way of judging. <laughs> if the <laughs> followers are Like, this is what I'm supposed to tell you. Okay, so. You know, like, you know, that, that will show us a different side of. <laughs> of the people that. <laughs> Yeah. Just, anyway, let's get into the question. Yeah, this will be light. So at the end, we'll gauge whether our, our on a followers scale of are one to ten. Joyriders are intelligent, oh, but or fast, not. yeah. No, but joyriders are intelligent. I yeah. mean, um, but of course, with this one now, this is like an exam, so we have to gauge. Let me read the, uh, the feed, some of the feedback that we've been receiving from the last video that we did with Wamoshe and Nigel. So Wamoshe, of course, is right up there. Thank you guys for having us. We had a blast. Joyride Jew. It's how I Jews like this is a political party. <laughs> Jared Wapi. Jew. Oh, mama, hoi. Hoi. <laughs> and then Rila Thiambo is saying it was such a li lively episode and you guys definitely chose the right people. Nigel and Wams are so amazing and they are intelligent. Loved it. <laughs> um, Chebet Nora is saying St. Anne's jokes never get old. Yeah, they never get old. I mean, I love St. Anne's. And you have and them always on standby. <laughs> and just to show you how much I love St. Anne's, I part, I, 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 I collaborated, <laughs> I collaborated with, 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 with one of St. Anne's um, old students. They're called alumni. Alu alu alumni. <laughs> <laughs> Alice, <laughs> Kimanzi. <laughs> Alice Kimanzi was in, in St. Anne's. It's always inspiring to see people just... Um, create great brands and yet while it's in the boom like it's just inspiring so big shout out to you alice kimanzi even you and jiru jiru lonzi as well yeah Lonzi yeah was yeah lonzi it's, yeah. it's, it's it, there's something there's always like you know gold has to go through fire and i guess being in set has that's the fire anyway <laughs> so do you have another comment or we go so straight many to the comments questions. let me just um read one more then we do the questions joyride to the world and now with guests it's on a whole new level oh that's nice um it's ben saying how when asked if he wants to familiarize himself with it i don't 
I don't know what that means, mm, but I'm it. sure it's something. <laughs> All episodes are my favorite. Stephanie Cherono is saying so hilarious. Thank you, thank you. I'll give you some. You read Kwakitian show because that's where you can read <laughs> yeah. them as much that's, as that's you That's actually want. what you do. I even know SMS line. Yeah. 151. <laughs> All right, go straight to the questions because mm-hmm. I've introed. Ah, these are the questions by you guys. Do, so do, do. I keep saying disappoint <laughs> Naizima Swali. Who's most likely to la- to drive on long trips? <laughs> well, well, well. Do you want to tell them? Uh, uh, that's me. That's me. Um, that's definitely you. Usually I found your driving license in the car and I was shocked. <laughs> you actually have a driving license. <laughs> but you don't have one. Uh, but it's nowadays driving license. No, but you have the new one. Nivile Jatoka. I applied. Yeah, you applied for oh. the new one. It says that it's, it's not yet. Same if you guys are watching Symphony Lake too. <laughs> yeah, but if if we're to do long distance trips, I'm the one who's driving. I don't even think Wanjiru drives for long distances. Like, what's the farthest you've driven to? Maybe Juja. Yani Juja is the farthest. Uki and Ivio. This other side is maybe Karenish. So the farthest you've gone to this side is Juja. Mm. Why would, Mas- I, why, would I drive, why would I drive so far and I have you? Okay, that's okay. Who's most likely to strike up a conversation with a stranger, Ben? That's me. Yeah. You I am not in the business of... Shake. You start fainting. <laughs> I'm not in the business heart of is palpitating <laughs> because uh, a stranger me kuambia anapenda joyride. <laughs> now you don't know what to tell them now. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Um, who's most likely to have dance parties by themselves when no one else is home? Me. Only because I'm usually home more. Yeah. Than you are. That, does doesn't that like feel a bit creepy? Like just have dance parties? No, I enjoy my own company, Ben. I am able to so give you myself dance. a good time. Yeah. When Hello. I'm not here, you're dancing in this house. Yeah. We're not joking, you know, the other day when I was looking for something to post you, I found like a video of us dancing in the house. It's so funny. <laughs> I'll show you I after this. That. No, I can't, of course Street I can't cred. I can't share it on social media. Hmm. But it was so funny, I'll show you. Um, it's the dancing at home for me. You know, I always tell guys on KTN, like, hey, so get your dancing shoes on. I didn't think, like, <laughs> it was know. actually <laughs> yeah, like my wife and a kwanga apple, like, with her dancing stockings. <laughs> what is my number one favorite cuisine or food? You, mm. uh, ugali, beef, and greens. So that's cuisine. Is it Kenyan? Is it African? Oh, cuisine, money, shape. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, I don't know. It's Kenyan. Uh, Ke- Ke- and Kenyan, to be very, very specific, Luya land food. Western. <laughs> kind of. Okay. Uh, what signs, what, what's my favorite cuisine? Oh, yours. Nobody's asking me questions uh, on the jury today. Yes, it's also Kenyan. And the chapo. What, what? Chapo and Minji. <laughs> Not Minji, yak. <laughs> Maybe. But chapo. Yeah, chapo and anything. Beef, chapo, bosho. Beans, chapo beans. Yeah. I've taught guys how to cook chapo beans. Nepalese. Yeah. Um, then you decided you know never Nepalese. again am I going to post food content on the joyride. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you triggering Barak? <laughs> <laughs> what signs do I show when I'm nervous? You don't talk. Yeah, I get very quiet. Yeah. Most times before I go on stage. <laughs> it's really funny that we have shot this before and I don't think you remember some of the answers. How do I get nervous? Yeah, yeah we show? actually da- did this. We actually did this episode before, but Justin decided to restock our CD. And so CD put a scratch and now we have to redo it. It's like we're in the 50s all over again. He was trying something yeah, new yeah, with the yeah, CD. Yeah. Like they're back. Justin Nyayo. <laughs> <laughs> no. So, yeah. What, what, what science do I show? So when you get nervous, mm. you you get you you're always on edge. What does that mean? Be easily irritable, um, talking in a panicky way. Yeah. Okay. It's define like talking in a, in a panicky way. It's like, hey Ben, call him to food a jacuja. <laughs> I'm like, mm, I don't I'm talk like, like that. that. They call it this like a winy whiny voice. You get. <laughs> don't know how you do. Shut up. Yeah. That's rude. What is my most hated food? All oh, these questions are quite interesting. Yeah, they look simple, but they're really not simple. What's your most hated food? What's the one thing that you never eat? Minji. You never yeah. eat minji. For you, it's njahe. Yeah, njahe is, njahe is trash, man. No, it's not. Kwanza gideri and njahe is really no, nice. No, but, but I actually like njahe to some extent, but in a lot of acidity. But okay. the historic fika Twitter. <laughs> if I could, If I could change anything about the way you were raised, what would it be? I think like Vile Okay, so you Vile and Taisema but drive mob. Wait, wait. <laughs> yeah. 
like to a fault to sometimes like you don't take stops because mm. you know it's always did, did you go, guys go, have go, a, go, go. Did you guys have a bell no no did you <laughs> no, it's just cause like when I'm going to say come a matron or like hey, hey it's a new day <laughs> my formations for you if I could change one thing about my I could change right if I'm the one who could change so, I, so I'm the one who's supposed to answer for you oh then I've answered for you so then you answer for me no you say what you would change about me my bringing see, but me I've already now given you an answer see just let me give it again okay yeah oh if one thing I would change about myself growing up mm, Okay, ninge, at least ninge acha kuchapua sana. I think your kuchapua was good for discipline. Yeah, but it, but it really it was a lot. <laughs> like it's, uh, it's um it's life threatening. Life threatening, you know. You're only walking this, around. My life is on the line. Yeah, just looking for blood donors. What is my favorite memory of our relationship? Well, these are very quick fire kind of questions. What's your favorite? I think your favorite memory of this relationship is the um, uh proposal. Don't we cram easy answers. <laughs> Like, <laughs> <laughs> before um, it's the proposal. Yeah. Right. Yeah. What about me? The day I came into your life. No. Then our wedding day. Imagine no. if you don't. Oh. Our wedding is not the most favorite. No. Okay. I know. I know. I was joking. Yeah. I was coming to Part C. Yeah. Cape Town. Definitely. Cape Town yeah. was like. The Cape Town was life. Um. What's my biggest pet peeve? Wow, sikumbuki answer. I I see answer. Ni kitu I have too many pet peeves. You can just pick any. Um people who come into the car and then you know the way the car has mats and then you step on the side. side yeah, yeah but you don't use the mat. You don't ever raise that issue with anyone because I always And your way is always on edge. <laughs> Every time I carry Nyawera, I always have to call my car wash guy. Umefunga? Neza pitia. So, so I thought it was um, it was a petty thing until I nearly check what car group. Juzi, I'm, I'm on this car group on Facebook. It's called Baraza JMs. It has mm. so many people. Mm. So a lot of people posted the same thing mm. uh, that Kukanyaga side. Side. Yeah. It's, it's unnecessary. Yeah. What's your biggest pet peeve? Um. People who don't keep time. Okay, yeah. People who don't keep time, you get so agitated. Yeah. What is my number one favorite fast food to eat? Your favorite fast food to eat? McFries. McFries without a doubt you? Yes. Oh, oh yours mm. is I don't know if Subway qualifies for fast food. Fast food. Yeah, Subway is fast food. Then f- Subway. But then again I learned cuz you cuz you thought you think it's healthy food. But the meat is processed, so I had. So if, if it's a scam, Osumo Brad needs to do something because I have fast food, fast food, and cheap, you know. Who is most likely to make a big purchase? You definitely. When Jiru Jiru is most likely to make a huge purchase. Wait, like you're yeah, shopping, Nini? Yeah, like a huge purchase that costs money. Um, it's you. Why? Like what? Okay, maybe it's me. Yeah, it's definitely you. Yeah. You buy a lot of stuff. Yeah. Buy a lot of clothes. Yeah. Mm. Okay, proceed. But today is my birthday, by the way. By the way, today is my birthday. Why are we not even <laughs> doing? Why are we not even like it's making it a big? Today when we are shooting. Today when we are shooting this is my yeah. birthday. So leo ndio leo ndio nikajinulia nguo mob sana. This was actually part one of them. Yeah. And it's because I had a voucher. <laughs> if I were to if I were able to live to the age of 90 and retain either my mind or body of a 30 year old for the last 60 years of your life which would I want mind myself mind, mind. for you it's the body no it's really the mind you really love your body but I also love my mind more watch away smart who is my main role model and who do i usually look, or who do i usually look up to these questions are very interesting Who's your main role model yeah is it still shabesh <laughs> 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 no it's you're right who is talking to kylie nani 
ule mwenye anakuanga partner wao aki unaikanga Kardashians unadhani those are my main role models no 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 the no scenes ule mwenye wao Emma na we do this this is the second time we're shooting this and video let me tell you even on the third and the fourth time <laughs> i will still not remember her name so you get that Emma yeah so for you it's mine? Lewis and kwanza he had such a good streak you want to deny him and he had such a good streak a good yesterday streak this weekend he's it's been because he's been through so much <laughs> so you racism and all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and people are playing mad when they're going to watch him. I imagine that like people can be so racist that when you know like a top of some black stuff on their face just to go watch him racing but he still beat them. He's the best driver of his generation. Okay, Actually mo- of all time. Who is most likely to clean up after a party that's Ben? This question is short quick quick. Yeah, but yet Ask- in the at night you sleep late and then you leave everything on the table. It's because mo- who is most likely to clean up joy comes in the morning, in the morning. <laughs> that's you and tabitha <laughs> who is more likely to wake up after an argument first me who's most likely to make up after an argument first what? are you new it's that's me ben you. it's really me oh, you don't don't you lie say sorry you i say more sorry than you. you always have to wait for me to come and tell you sorry and bembeleza like you, you trauma. and bembeleza you you seem like you have trauma you seem like you have trauma smile, smile. smile. <laughs> seem like you have trauma it's not trauma it's reality do you think um, these are the questions that will be there on the 16th on the 16th mm-hmm. ah, but it can never be barak barak is nakwanga refu refu like like ben part one is yours <laughs> part two you need a calculator and part three go am i more extroverted or introverted you You're are more, introverted you are extroverted mm-hmm. high five let's go what is my number one favorite restaurant i'm sure you will say the one we visited this past two weekends because you can't remember anything else mateos didn't i say it <laughs> didn't i say it <laughs> <laughs> Karen, what's mine? Yours is Oh wait. Oh wow. Oh, even me then I'll say it. red ginger. No. <laughs> what's yours? Meso, I'm into Japanese food. You, you've gone there once and you didn't even finish the food. Yeah, yeah. And then it's miso. <laughs> yeah. It's not meso. <laughs> it's miso. It's miso. I was out there on their menu looking for like a Toyota sandwich. They really it was right there. They disappointed. Like miso. It's like you're a liar. You're Sony. a you're a liar Sony. and you're a fake. <laughs> Get get out of here. <laughs> who will who will most likely be first in line at a concert to get up front and be able to touch their favorite band or singer Ben? Me, definitely. Yes, me. Ben. I have no shame. Whenever <laughs> I meet people I admire online, I always tell them whether they have more followers or less followers or if they're celebrities or they're not celebrities, I go crazy. Just, Sometimes it's actually borderline psycho fancy. And it, what about it, you? But that day you saw Shebesh in town you were <laughs> and it was a political rally so I was like you can't go say hi to her <laughs> something will happen yeah out of going out to dm um who is most likely to cry during a sad movie oh it's obvious you Cry during you d- ben when you thought is there's no amount of gangster points people can take away from you like you're in a different <laughs> level of life i can't cry, cry on a movie cry. what's wrong with you <laughs> if you cried you cried I, I have which movie is this that you made in manhattan you cried how is even made in manhattan <laughs> you, cried. Movie? <laughs> you cried i didn't cry and, you and why would you even do this on so national emotional. i Right. No, 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 no. That's not true. Yeah, yeah, that is not. Nobody is going to tell you. Swearing with the Bible before we sit on this seat. Who's most likely to have text messages full of typos and or emojis? Typos. Mm. Typos, it's me. You remember the message to TuneCore? Oh, what, 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 what is the to, message to TuneCore? I need to get it. Give me your phone. Somebody well, give my me. My phone is far, far. You can remember no. it. Just, just, just. I have to read it word for word for people no, to just, understand. Just paraphrase it because no. going for the phone will have to. I'll, will require so, so just, many things. Can someone pass me the phone? I have to read it. Stop so Ben was having a challenge with like TuneCore, who are his what are they distributor. called? Distributor of his music. So he accidentally gave them the rights to distribute YouTube. YouTube. So that means they collect and all this we are fighting about is 20% revenue because they they give him 80%, they take 80%. I don't want them to take that 20%. I don't want Let them me to just, take any money on YouTube. Wait, where is this email? I think we'll get paraphrased. Oh, here it is. 
um and realize that there are no what are they called punctuation marks hi team i wanted to request you to please remove my youtube account from being monetized by tuneco not monetized <laughs> i would love to do that myself i love what tuneco does and i would be okay with you guys <laughs> With you, I would be okay having you guys manage Spotify, Apple, and other platforms, other full stop platforms. But I would want to monetize YouTube myself. The link shared is not working for me. Please help as the song goes up tomorrow morning. Thank you and look forward to hearing from you. Attached is a link that is. What's working. wrong with that? <laughs> like it's so emotional. It's not so Okay, in short, ni likuatuna jari boku ambie kwa Kiswahili. Ni wa semu na do job boa. Na ni wa semu na saidi yanga independent artist. Like in independent to YouTube yangu. Like in independent to YouTube yangu. Nastaki muni chukie. But YouTube wacha neni na ayo na muwacha na ayo kabisa kabisa. Yeah, there was such a huge difference between when you type when you talk to them. When I was when I was when I was uh, te- texting. Who is most likely to stay up all night watching movies? That's definitely Ben, not you. you yeah. Sleep? What time do you sleep? Nine. You sleep so early, man. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Read. So yesterday, when I was kid, I was leaving the couch at like three a.m. Who's most likely to leave you on uh, red? Even you answer that one. I. <laughs> you. I'm not sure about this question. This question. Who is most likely to leave your dread? You just say. That's me. Yeah. Because I take. I'm just a. I don't know what to say. Don't defend yourself. It's you're just. Me. You're just pathetic at texting. Who is most likely to be late? That's you. When you're doing your concealer, you're fenty. Or every Sunday, you wake up before me. I prepare. I leave But you in the house. Who is most likely to be late? You are always late. I leave the house before you. On Sunday. Uki, 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 on Sunday. Uki funga shulises. Pana. Nakuanga po kipaka concealer. Who's most likely to bring home a stray animal? Say it. You know, so far in games, like if we had a house that had a huge compound, we could not come on a patangombe, mbuzi. Drew is adopted. Randomly, two is to go to the yard. And now they're looking for me because that's no. cattle rustling. <laughs> What would I need to have for a job? Um. I generally don't think you can be a waiter. Why? I don't We think you're that them. patient. Then I think actually the job I, I I don't think hate is a word. I wouldn't be able to do is a teacher. Oh, oh kids. Oh my goodness. Not even kids. You d- explain to some somebody something over and over till yeah. they understand. I don't know. Even patience. on the Jared whenever communication imekuwa issue na mimi siku. Na unani explain yanga sijui aje. I d- I feel like you need to understand it for yourself. Do you think it stems from a place of pride? Let me just do a small little therapy here. Pride? Yeah. From what? I just where don't have think, the patience where you to think keep you're on. too good for us. No, it's just that I don't have the patience. There's no correlation. So for for you What? The job you'd hate to have. A job that I'd hate to have. I'd, I'd, I, I wouldn't want to be a doctor. Why? Because I'd be so emotionally attached to all my to patients. patients. Yeah. Okay, me, I, would, I, would, I would say engineer. I'm just there like Because five years later. Because it's a mathematics. Hey, but I'm not a mathematics. I'm just like, 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 Do I usually like to plan more than improvise or the other way around? You imp- you plan more. I think it's a mixture of both, 50-50. Oh, tell me more about how you improvise, Ben. Attend the live. The link is on the description <laughs> below. Because <laughs> you, you also don't know how you... You imp- like more planning. You rarely improvise. I always improvise. You're like a robot. No, I plan, but I always am I'm, I'm free I'm open minded in the sense that the plan can go wrong mm. and I'm flexible to adjust. You on the other hand you're inflexible. Like if you were supposed to do this at this time and something comes up, mm. you'll get pissed. I mean, all I hear is order. Well, no. That's all I'm hearing you say. I'm say order 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 order. Who is most pangano. likely to break something valuable? That's you. I just broke two glasses. Like you've broken so many things. Like what else? House. Um Or glasses. Like there was a time yeah, in this house, even if you wanted to drink juice, <laughs> you could a cup here, my body, or like you. cup of chai. So anyway, that's not that I'm total. I can't find well, a liar. You mean? <laughs> uh, who's most likely to have their phone run out of battery during the day? That's one Jiru, Jiru, because she's always on her phone. But that's Take. incorrect. You're the one who's always out of charge. But me, I always find a way to charge. 
When when was the last time you called me and I was mteja? How many times Ben do I find you struggling to look for a charger because you are 2%, 1%? <laughs> yeah, safe to say mki come uh, live experience please be back extra cables. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Wako to charge sim. <laughs> Who is most likely to get a speeding ticket? I don't think here the issue is speeding tickets, but um that's definitely me. Thank you. Just, I thought you were going to lie. No, that's me. That's me. That's me. I'm definitely most likely to get a speeding ticket. This is interesting. What is my favorite childhood memory? This is interesting. I think going to Ushago. <laughs> and then <laughs> blending and bonding mm. with the children who've been brought up there. So you used to run around without any shoes just because you wanted to like fit in with the kids there. Yeah. That was cool. It wasn't bad. It yeah. was really interesting. Yeah. Um Afku bebeshwa mawarus. Kutoka Shago. Yeah. You know, you know it's a different ball game whenever you go to. You told me you've never gone to Shago using public transport. But to the point where I can remember. As we used to use public transport. And now you see the worst part is when you're coming back from Ushago. Hmm. So like you come kupatia kama gunia moja ya waru, alafu kuna gunia moja ya cabbage, alafu it's just my mom, my bro and myself. We are just three. <laughs> so um in that setup I'm like the strongest kayang boy. And then sasa is all gari because ni too laga and the green is not to drop up over Thiru. First you have to cross the road and then you also have to carry part of the cabbage. And then at that stage umeanza kukatia to dem kwa hiyo. Unajua? Alafu tena wana kuona umebeba cabbage. Those are not. Ay 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 ya madel kona ribu drip. What's your favorite childhood memory? I'd say when you when you guys moved from Nyeri and you came to Nairobi. <laughs> too, too bad. Stop doing that. You're copying whatever was on the CD and you're bringing no, no, it. No, no, no. How could I have remembered that? I was six months. I don't know. Maybe different environment. What on English? So I But it was six see, months. Wanna... Like, what What can I process at six months? Okay, okay. So just tell us then. See, yeah, you me, tell me. See, Pia, me, I'm also on this episode. To, to know you more. <laughs> So just tell me what's your favorite childhood memory? I think it's just growing so closely with my sisters. Now what kind of a boring <laughs> is that actually you wanted me to remember that like there's no excitement there. I really don't have like fun like memories yeah. and and I have a couple. I sit- mm. There was I remember when we were kids my dad would take us to Sari Center. Oh. And Sari Center used to have like um it was like to choppers where you pay like 20 bob alafu ina kupeleka juu. So well to just like, move like from here all the way to here and you'd but it like, was fun it was really fun for me as a child when i show, had a lot of those but i can't you used remember. to go for show yeah oh for real but with the school of course i also used to go to for to, to the show ground with my mom i think i used to go with the school then i pick up face painting ah merry go round yeah who's most likely to fake a cold to skip work that's you Okay you you'd go to work with the cold. Yeah, you'd go like spread covid uh, uh, in the office. This is the problem we had in 2020 with human beings just being selfish. So it's you. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> um but but there is a cold squang in kifake. For real colds in Hong Kong is later. Who's most likely who, who most likely can eat all the pizza and still have room for more if someone else was buying dinner at midnight? That's me. Thank you. That's me. I'm actually very hungry right now yeah you don't eat and you know what pisses me off about your eating? the question was who is most likely to have we have to easy which is also is ingine we have to expound the addition have to expound you know when you can stay hungry the whole day i know mona kicho at one point kwa wedding you even fainted <laughs> you remember when you oh, were no, fainting was, no, i was sick i had an infection i went to the hospital and also had an infection yeah Or lack of food. No, it was then you're wrong. That one was a lot of things. It was dehydration caused by like an infection that I had. It was just lack of food, but anyway. Who is most likely to sleep in on a Sunday? To sleep in on a Sunday? Kulala sana on Kulala a Sunday. Kulala Jumapili. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. uh, that's you. Sleeping? Yeah. But I have work on Sunday so mostly it's you. Kila siku ni kama juma pili. I was most likely to have a phone number from years ago because they never delete contacts no matter how long it's been. That's me. Mitcha, mitcha. That's me. 
It's me. I don't delete my contacts. I have. Yeah, okay, you don't delete, but you don't know how to transfer because you never store things in the cloud that's, and that's everything. Transferring so things. whenever you, you move phones, you lose <laughs> everything. <laughs> but now with iPhone, you just. Yeah. Easier. What is my number one favorite drink? Coffee. Yeah. You, <laughs> Mala. No, yeah, we <laughs> don't even drink Mala. Okay, wait, let me see. Water. Water. Yeah. What's my favorite thing about <laughs> yourself? Um, My kind heart. What? Let me, <laughs> let me just repeat this question. What's my favorite thing about okay, I'll say, yourself? Oh, Cindy or me? Mm. I'm very kind. My favorite thing about you is not, it's not your kindness. It's? It's raw safi. <laughs> What's, uh, What's the difference? Uh, the favorite thing about yourself is that you actually like you can be called out. Now you will. And yeah, Miss Julia, <laughs> let's just go with what you said, kindness. <laughs> What's oh, it's because you said you can be called out. Oh, that's not true. Yeah, that's that's not true at all. What what about you? Your sense of humor. There's nothing else I bring to the table. Nothing. And that's why I'm here in this relationship still holding on. It's quite underwhelming. Who is most likely to call their parents every week? That's me. Yeah, I think it should have been every minute. And I'm not it's a really shit. how your mom sometimes avoids you. I'm not a <laughs> shit. That's me, <really> talks. <laughs> Can you imagine when you're calling your own mother? She's like, she's had it up. <laughs> But why would you laugh so evil? Because it's because it's always so funny whenever she's trying to do it. I'm like, Mama, I get you. I will do the same thing too. <laughs> what is something I want us to do together that we haven't? Road trip to Ethiopia. Why would I want to do that? Why would you? And their flights. Would like, why would I want to take <laughs> See, a trip across borders <laughs> on road no, for like, hours? That's the whole point. I like know. you're driving that's on not road. Something I, and I feel like wait, I, I is it something you want to do or something it's I something want to do. Something I want to oh, do. Oh, I thought you were saying mm. it as something I want to do. Yeah, we should do a road trip. And I'm, I'm in fact, I don't think I've I'm started show up. I've started by telling you guys let's just do Namanga. Namanga is like three hours from I'm here. not gonna show up for a trip to Ethiopia on road. So what do you want? It will just take flights to tell me to go. Who is most likely to go the longest without checking their phone. Me? Yeah, me. And and you think I, I I think it's a family thing because you've not met my mom. My oh, she can go like half yeah. day without checking her phone. Yeah. I'm like, wow. I was 1940, mom. Um given the choice of anyone in the world, whom would I want as a dinner guest? Lewis Hamilton. Yashinsky. Lewis. Um I feel like okay. Lewis. What about you? See you say. You're saying for me. Um who would you want to have dinner with? Who would you want to have dinner with? Who would you want to I surely need paper too. So you need the second Emma. Emma. Exam. It's Emma. So Emma. Um who is most likely to do the grocery shopping? Ben. His wife. One zero. Thank <laughs> you. You're right. Your turn. Yeah, man, they're quick. Thanks, guys, for this question. Yeah, um, I'm happy. We are eight, they look simple, I think, but they're really, minutes. They look simple. How, how can you tell? Up oh. from the... They look simple, but they're really not simple. Yeah. Who's most likely to remember your birthday without an app reminder? That's that's one zero. That's one zero. In fact, there's one thing that... One of the advantages of having one zero uh, logged onto the Instagram is that she tells me sometimes <laughs> celebrating their birthday <laughs> and then I immediately call them. We really need to stop discussing this thing about Instagram and passwords. Yeah, because somebody DM'd me the other day and they were they were really, I think they were appreciating the new song or something like that. And then <laughs> midway they were like, so say hi to Wanjiru. But anyway, if Wanjiru, you've seen this first. Okay, so hi. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the funny thing is, <laughs> you mean Leonor? Yeah, but I don't know Leonor Kwanza. Like, it was so funny. What's, the, what's my favorite thing about me? What's my favorite thing about me? Your brain. Is it, is hey, it political. Is, you're not going to think political a lot today. instability, climate change, <laughs> and borders. <laughs> What's mine? Your sense of humor. <laughs> For me? <laughs> it's political instability, climate change. It's actually my drive. For, for what in my life do you... Drive for? Like just things, like... Um, drive for humans, humanity. You don't think like I can win a Nobel? <laughs> <laughs> just 
Please ask the question. For what in my life do you feel most grateful? Your sense of humor. Oh, come on, come on, <laughs> come on. Um, no, like at you for what? What are you most? What What are you grateful the most about my life? The fact that you're alive. Yeah. Yeah, I am so one of the things that I'm grateful to, uh, to um, about you is uh, you you fear God. So sometimes I know if you don't listen to me, <laughs> and if you're rebellious, God, God and a corner. <laughs> what is my favorite book? Oh, you have so many favorite books. Uh, name one. Um, Sex Lives of African Lives of African Women. Um, it's just a book that you Atomic, saw me with the last Atomic Habits. Those are the books that you saw with. You saw me with the last. You walked, you walked around everywhere with those books. Doesn't mean they're my favorite. How can you walk around with every? How can you be going because everywhere you're reading with the books it? You don't like. You're reading it. And after that, you recommended it highly. I even posted it on my IG. <laughs> so which and is, guys were so happy that I'm reading books. My favorite is I think Transcendent Kingdom. Hmm? What's it? And I was reading it all through hmm? coasts. Last year in December. Let me tell you, in Mombasa, I did not even check what you were reading. I didn't even bother. I <laughs> with what I, I was doing I with thought, my I life. I thought you were very weird going for holiday with a book. You know, like, that was crazy. You, what do you do? Which book? Um, Yours? Yeah, yeah. Your journal. No, your diary. Where no, you no, just no, no. write, call this. Um, my, my My favorite book is actually Betty DJX. Don't drop the mic. <laughs> <laughs> Which page are you in? Are you finished? I'm now currently approaching chapter three. What is the book about? T.D. Jakes is just giving his personal story. <laughs> and he's also teaching people the importance of... Um, the importance. Being a good speaker. <laughs> I, don't, I don't get why you're laughing. To be very, very honest. I don't the understand importance. why importance. Okay, like the advantages <laughs> of... Advantages? Uh, <laughs> no, I'm just trying to say that I've been reading that book. So you're in chapter three now. I'm in chapter three. When did you start it? Um, you know the book is so deep. Sometimes I take pauses just to reflect on what he's saying the whole chapter. So uh, I don't want to be cash. I don't want to be one of those people. You don't want to be cash. Yeah, I don't want to be one of those people who rush through books. Remember when the year started and I was reading? <laughs> I was reading Atomic Habits. I even posted on Instagram. So did you finish Atomic Habits? Yeah. Really? Yeah. What did you learn most from the book? That for you to create a habit, it has to start with um. You have to be intentional about like that was in literally chapter one when he, when of the he, book. Okay, why are you making it look bad? Like if my biggest takeout is from chapter one. So how did you finish? How can you prove you finished the book? Do you have like a small set of questions? Yeah, pass me the. Is it there? It's not here, unfortunately. <laughs> Do check. It's not there. here for real. No, down there. There's. It's not here. Oh, pass me. Don't drop the mic. Ah, uh, don't drop the mic. Is also not. Here. I can see it right there. But I'm reading it. Why do you want to inter- interfere with the bookmark? Who is most likely to take the most selfies when you go out somewhere? That's 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 me. Yeah, that's thank me. you. That's quite embarrassing, but, but it's, it's me. You. It's me. Would I like to be famous? <laughs> Guys, like okay let's let them answer that one let's let them in the comment section <laughs> okay so so guys we need, we need you to answer this question do you think Wanjiru would want to be famous or do you think ben would who who do you think is more fame hungry than, between the two yeah. of us Put and i hope you guys section. are honest enough <laughs> one of the things i love about joy riders is that you guys are smart and you can see when somebody's trying to fake yeah what did you think of the question the questions were they looked simple but they really make you think yeah yeah, it's like when somebody asks you, what did you have for dinner last week on Wednesday? I can't remember. I See, you didn't eat. that's how these questions feel. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Remember, 16th July, we're coming to Daystar and it's absolutely free, 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 free. Thanks to ALX yes. Africa. So the best thing you can do for yourself mm. is click the link, register mm. so that you can come and have a good time. Very simple. Very yeah. simple. See you guys next time. Adios.